안녕. 시미가. Welcome to Ready My Reviews and Reactions. And always don't forget to hit the like, subscribe, and ring that bell for notifications. And lastly, please support us on our Patreon. All right, guys. Now let's get it. So for this week's episode is episode 509, titled Superpower School Race: War of Superpowers: The End Game. And our guests are Kang Hana, Yi Sang Yup, and our missions are. The first mission was walking with a third eye, and then. Unfortunately, we didn't get to see a second mission, so they just went right to the third, the last mission, which was the end game. Yeah. So, <clears throat> they were all given superpowers this time, and we get to see them go through the whole process of any every Running Man superpower race where they drink their potion, they learn about their superpowers, what they need to chant, what does it do, and everything like that. And the missions, it's not just that at the end of the mission, the final mission, you could just use your powers however you want. Throughout the missions, you're supposed to win points to see how many times you can use it. So it's still limited you to use your superpowers. Yeah. Yeah, because yeah, some, <laughs> obviously from the old episodes, um, the members so were members who had really, really powerful powers. And when they were able to use it an infinite amount of times, it kind of like really made them overpowering. Yeah. So because of um, they... Oh, what was I going to say? I to it totally left my head. Oh, so just because we thought it was like a superpower mission, mm -hmm. it's the beginning, the PD sits, it because Running Man's um, 10th year anniversary is coming in two weeks, they are going to, and the number one watch, like, most favorite fans, viewers episodes is actually superpower. So they are actually doing it this way, and whoever gets lo the last person standing wins. The pe the person who loses gets to get their penalty that they're going to carry on until the actual 10th uh, anniversary episode where they're going to be doing a live broadcast where that person is going to be getting punished. And it's not just one person. Apparently next week's episode, another person is going to get punished yeah, so as well. Be. Yeah, so they're going to get punished. So... They, it's just all superpowers and they're winning points and everything and they're gonna get to use it everybody's trying to figure out their powers like how they always are and everything like that but apparently that was not all of it yes so there is a human intruder among the superpowers one of the students are actually not a part or never accepted into the superpower school and they're just regular human and they don't have powers and that person has to wait until five members are eliminated in, in before they can go and start eliminating the members and they have to win so apparently according to ratings it was Kim Jong Kook and Suk Jin who had the worst powers of never winning whenever it, com whenever it comes to superpower rating but Kim Jong Kook's rating was even lower than Suk Jin yes so because he, he had the worst powers and he was like always one of the early ones to get eliminated yeah so because of that, he is actually the human intruder for this episode and he had to wait and he doesn't have any powers and so he basically, he's, his power, he doesn't have any, period. Yeah. So and everybody has it, he doesn't. Yeah, so yeah. He, he can only eliminate people through regular means, but obviously there was like the, the little special room that, the, that people with superpowers could not eliminate, mm -hmm. but he could since he didn't have superpowers. Yeah, so... With that, he waited till the end, and then he couldn't eliminate two people, and so it showed us at the end that Kim Jong Kook will be getting a punishment that he will be carrying on onto the Running Man's anniversary, and yep. he's going to be punished. He's going to be in a costume, and so next week we're going to be seeing who else is going to get punished. Yes. And um, as for the penalties, we picked immediately who our people are going to be. I put I picked. Jihyu, who had the bodyguard summon, she gets to summon, and Ajishi got Jaesuk, who had the ring, the Thanos snap ring. He had a gold Thanos ring. <clears throat> yes. Yeah, so. He had very powerful power. Yeah, it's just. I think his was the strongest because he could freeze three members mm -hmm. um, for for a minute. Yeah, for but a minute. But obviously he could pick himself, in which he did. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, and then stupid stuff said, could just. Could I just leave him alone? So <laughs> <laughs> said this is his first time getting powers. He was so excited. Yeah, but it's he became like, trigger happy. He was like, ooh. Yeah, but it's like, 
go 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 kill someone else. <laughs> yeah. Like go go penal go p- paralyze someone else. Not the same person that you can't <laughs> be. It's because of how much Jacek means. So he's like he had to because Jacek is like, you know, the captain. <laughs> but next week's Anyways, episode is the 2020 reincarnation race. Ooh. So reincarnation is actually number two on the most watched and view from fans and viewers yes. for Running Man. And as we've seen in the past, they've done tons of reincarnations and all these stuff mm-hmm. like that. They've done like yeah. a few like different versions of reincarnation, yeah. but none has been better than the very first reincarnation they yeah. did. Where they were like in the 1930s and they came back yeah, to it was the vampire. with the gold. No, you know they made fun of him that he was the vampire. Oh, the vampire! There you <laughs> go. He looks exactly the and same. then they were incarnated. They got reincarnated <laughs> to someone else and everything like yeah. that. Yeah. Yeah, so they're actually, uh, that's actually, uh, that is actually one of Ajishi's favorite episodes, yes. honestly. Well, re- so- you really think about it, like, superpowers and reincarnation are, are, are two of our favorite episodes. And it's like, another one's like Rage Virus. Yeah. You know, so, but uh, we really love those two episodes, and I'm very sure all the Rain Man members love those episodes, too. Yeah. Well, uh, that's our episode for next week, and our guests are Zico, Lee Do-hyung, Sun Min, and Sai Ho. So they are joining us again. So instead of because of its Running Man's anniversary, instead of bringing new guests, they're just bringing old guests that has been with them multiple times, who's known them, who's connected yeah. with them, who's understand <clears throat> everything, and so they're just joining them. It's just like how Hana and sang they've been, they went with them on the penalty trips and all this stuff like that, so right. they just came back yeah, and joined the, them. I, I don't think there's any, there's going to be doing any promotion, like promotion for any of the guests or anything. I think this is strictly, strictly just, for Running Man. just bringing back guests that are available and they that kind of know the Running Man format and then when they, whether they want to um, participate in that mission and it looks like based off preview this one is going to be different from the superpowers the superpowers is kind of indoors um, whereas this one the reincarnation looks like they're going to be kind of outdoors in a different and, place and indoors and they're running around it yeah. seems like some creepy stuff and right. all these things like that so we will see how that one turns out uh, we don't know yet what's the format and everything so we can't pick in advance who we are going to pick and so we'll save that for next week but now we're gonna get punished with our jelly beans yes. again yes Ugh. and we have no water who cares collect that This one does not look good. No. <laughs> yes! Uh, you're so gone. No, this you're one's not yellow. This is the yellow <laughs> I one. Know. You have two shit ones and a third one. <laughs> Let's go! Thanos! <clears throat> I got a weird flavor. Pink one's really sweet. Cotton candy. Mine's not too bad. I think I'm bad, but it's just weird. It hurt my teeth though. Mm. It's really sweet. Mmm. Mmm. The rubber is overkilling it all. <clears throat> yes. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, because that, that poop one. <laughs> the poop flavor one. <laughs> it's actually not. It's vanilla bean. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Oh, that's safe. Mm-hmm. Oh, I swallowed mine already. I feel so much more swallow. Oh. Okay. But that is it for this week, and we'll see you guys next week. <laughs> yes, please. Okay. <laughs> 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 I can't do it. I can't do it. No, we're not going to do it. We're not Ha <laughs> ha
Whoa, it protects from all superpowers. Fuck. <laughs> Do he has a ring? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you, <laughs> you must be really Thanos. Oh, <laughs> 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 like, oh, I would have snapped you. <laughs> yeah, she does that for oh. 30 seconds and then they go black. And for glasses? Remember, out he gets it. I know. What is happening? <gasps> oh, dude! Oh, oh no! <clears throat> Our members are out. Now they're dead. They you have... feel the <laughs> You feel the jerks. <laughs> Call straight up. You feel the jerks. <laughs> Oh, like the orangi 
versus the. Oh, this is gonna be horrible the, for him. Mission. Uh, oh, other oh. mission. Only Kim is not there. <clears throat> Kim Jong-gu? It's fake. 